Good evening. Oh. <coughs> I'm losing my voice a wee bit already, this isn't it? This isn't a good start. Oh, how's it going, mate? Billy settled nothing for less than a belly 1-1. One -one. Good. This is... I'm really really looking forward to this. I'm, I've been sitting, like, looking... This has been sitting in my desk. I work at this desk. So this has been sitting next to me all week. And I've been dying if I can open it. <laughs> so... Um, I will give it a wee minute, because I've been sitting... Frantically DMing folk and... Posting the place to various places. Uh, to tell people that I'm in. Super blue. How are we going? How's it going, mate? Oh. I feel like I'm a little better than I did L in the week, man. I thought I was going to try and push this to try and do L in the week, but I felt like rotten this week, man. Give them some daft, like, cold. I think loads of people are getting it. Um. So you can probably have my voice is still a bit kind of nasally, but I'm fine now, like... I'm not going to infect you, so... <laughs> when you get your cards. OG, how's it going, mate? Er... Uh, I wish this would... Streamlabs isn't very good at telling you... Isn't it very good at telling you how many people are watching? Doesn't it refresh often enough? Because there's more people chatting in this thing right now than there are that tell me this watching. Um, but I'll give it a wee minute. I'll give it a wee minute. I'll just make sure that I've actually messaged because there's about. Ethan Jace, how's it going? Welcome in. Actually, what I probably should do is explain what I'm trying to do with the format here, right? I've never done. Uh, I've done guaranteed hip breaks before, I've not done something since 24. Oh, that's plenty. Fubalicious, thank you very much for following. Much appreciated. So you see the top right corner of my screen right now in Streamlabs, it says 3. Well, there's 24, I mean, there's 20. There's totally 28 spots, and that's some people have done more than one. So I'm going to assume everybody's here. If not, there's, there is a VOD. So they're watching the VOD. A lot of the VOD crew. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to open this, everybody's name, as you can see, is on this spreadsheet that I've pulled together here. Um, I've got, who have I got, Paul's got two, Lee's got two, get, Niall, Billy, I have gave your second, you bought two, you gave one to Stuart, then you ended up buying another one for yourself anyway. Uh, ben Lee, Rob's got three, Michael, Sean, Raymond, Niall, Warren, this font's too... I really need to pull it up on the other screen two seconds. Warren, Jason, Mark, uh, Michael, Kyle's got two, and then Billy is your second one. Or your third one that you bought, but the second one for Stuart, that <laughs> kind of confused me a wee bit when I was putting the spreadsheet together. Reg's in for two, Stephen's got one, Ian, and then David picked up the last one. Evening Lee, how's it going? Um, so, what I'm going to do, as I pull these cards, I'm going to just add them quickly, just put like a player's name or something here on the spreadsheet and then at the end I'll just randomise it and whoever gets randomise the names and they'll randomise the I can randomise the names and then randomise the teams or I can do a duck race one or the other we'll see what folk are up for but uh, aye so whoever's card once I've done the randomizer, so I'm going to start typing them in here don't think that means you've got this isn't finished yet that spreadsheet will get finished when I've finished opening the box and then I've done a randomizer after it. Yeah, yeah there's my viewers numbers actually updated now. Yeah, just two seconds. Shuffling some stuff about there. This desk is awfully cramped at the moment. Because basically, this here is full of crap when I'm working during the week, and then it just gets. Everything's <laughs> okay. Stacks of cards and stuff that I've got to send to people over here in boxes. 
Um, so anybody, actually, a wee update for anybody who does have cards with me um, from last week and maybe a couple for the week before. I'll send them after this because I know there's quite a few people were in this and other ones, so I just club them together. But I think there's a few. I sent quite a bit of NFL stuff out this week. Like sealed boxes and stuff are all gone. So anyone that bought those from me should have them. I'd say I guess if you've not got them already, but tomorrow at the very latest. Um, but, without any further ado, let's get this thing opened. Be very careful. Does anyone want this box? This is a really nice box. Hi, Lewis, how's it going? Morning. <laughs> Where are you watching from? Um, noticed actually there is actually a couple. We've got Mike, we've got, uh, so I'm not going to dox end in actually where they're from. <laughs> but, uh, I could do a duck race at the end or something for the box, Tony Glenn. <laughs> different time zones <laughs> for the other side of the south side of Glasgow. It, look, it is, it's like a box. Actually, sure, sure, I've got a couple of boxes on my up there, I've got them down. It's about the length of a shoe box. Like, you know, like, buy a hobby box or a card product and you're like left a bit kind of like, oh, that looks a bit tiny in comparison to what you thought it would be. This is fucking massive. Like, so I can start the box. Anybody who wants this, hang about at the end of the stream and I'll run a raffle or a duck race or something for it. Um, and then I'll then need to figure out how I can post it to you because I've already used the box to post it up to somebody else. <laughs> this came in a box and then I think some of the other two blasters, so I just. made sense. Right. So I'll be very careful and try and not like scratch this up because normally I just hack fuck out of boxes when I open them. But I think if I get the wee seal here, the wee seam. Yeah, it is very much like a, a, a malt whiskey box. That's as finish on it as well, man. Like, anyway. Okay, so there's our four packs. Oh, wait a minute, there's a wee thing. Two. <laughs> fucking pointless into the floor. Remove this tray to store your cards. There you go. It's quite handy that. It's just the size, it's just the, the, the length of a top loader. Didn't know that. I'll put that back in for the time being. End of the ones, right, we'll do. We'll raffle off the box at the end then, right? And then I can figure out how I'm going to post it later. <laughs> but, uh, somebody, I like, somebody say, if somebody wants the box, it is actually like, you could probably fit about, you could probably fit about 100 odd top loaded cards into that. Pretty easily. Like, that was a, that was a 130 point top loader I put in that, so it's, aye. Hmm. Anyway, right, box number one, here we go. Nervous opening a box of cards, but right first out Vinicius Junior number to ten. Here we go. Right, oh, this, this is a start. Hey, right, I need to figure out a system. I need to get a figure out a system for doing this quickly. Really nice, like even the base cards. That's a red Venetius Junior to ten. Um I will see that one first. I've been very careful, I've ordered in like Aye. I've ordered in the correct top loaders for these, so the fifty five points are for the base, and one thirties are for the memorabilia, I remember that. Right. So good start. Right. Alaba B. 
base. Kamavinga base. <laughs> first, first memorabilia card is a Ronaldinho to 32. No, we're waiting to randomise it, sorry mate. Do you know what I'm going to do? Get that to fuck. That'll just confuse people. That'll just confuse the fuck out of people. So I'll, I will just move the spreadsheet away until I'm done with it. Right. Ronaldinho to 32. This card has a piece of Ronaldinho's football history featuring a piece of Brazil away game-worn jersey from a World Cup qualifier versus Ecuador on the 17th of November 2004. Oh, this set, man. I don't get my... I'm really fucking shite myself, but I don't do that. I do some fucking of these. I think sleeves. 130 point total loaders. So we've got our Ronaldinho game. That's The memory of your stuff in this is fucking excellent, by the way. But I don't know, I mean, they say it's obviously from that game, I'm going to just take another one. But when you get it tied to a specific game. Right, we've got okay, base cards again, Kimmich, Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho's stuck in my head now, Ronaldo. <laughs> a bad astuter. Right, quickly add these to the sheet, right. Ronaldinho memorabilia 32 and then base cards Ronaldo Kimmich Kamavinga I figure this is like slightly less tedious than doing them all at the end Alaba And Batistuta. Right, so that's one, two. That's our seven cards. Okay. Right, hey, we're off to the races here. <laughs> Probably better than I thought it would. These cards are set. I see, I'll, I'll, I'll sleeve and top load everything. Uh, I'll do the best cards in this at the end. But... There's no, like, I see, I've had a few Futera cards before they give you, like, exact games. Like, I've had one on one patches for, like, specific games. And they're, um... Yeah, so I can. Fuck knows how they source them, mind you, but that's. Was that a chunky bad boy in this one anyway? Eh, uh, alright, Heritage Van Nistelrooy, out in the next pack, that is number 19. So you get two Heritage inserts, I believe, in the box as well, which I think are numbered as well. Oh, and we should have four, like, kind of hits. Four numbered cards. We've got Neymar. Donnarumma. There's the... It's a dual patch, it's a dual patch, right? Nations. Um, Garito. A Mexico dual patch. The 35. So it's Irving Lozano. Irving Lozano's game piece, oh sorry, piece of game worn Napoli away jersey from a Serie A match. 2019-20 season and a piece of Javier Hernandez Mexico 
game warm jersey from the CONCACAF playoff versus America at the Rose Bowl in 2015. It's a fucking belter. So, that's a proper sleeve. Barrage type. The nation's cards look really nice. I don't think camera, like these, I've, I've watched quite a few boxes that's been open already, the camera doesn't really do all that much justice, but a game worn, a game worn piece of a Mexico jersey from a game against the USA is, I'd imagine there's a market for that. But, um, I don't know if we'll top the Ronaldinho, but that's... We've got a Bastoni. Bastoni 34. Got a Ronaldo. Base. I have its base and a tier The base cards are really, really nice. Dera are kind of hit and miss with me, but evidently this is... I like this. I really like this set. Nice, right, so we've got. Uh, Mexico, Joe, Punch, uh, Bastoni, Bastoni number two again, 34. Cards we had. Each of them as well, not read them yet. Just read the, the memorabilia ones. Guys breaking like 50, 60 boxes of them and stuff like that. It wasn't quite as bad as I remember the first unique football release they did. And the kind of big breakers ended up with almost everything. Like it sold out in milliseconds. Um, at least this time, the kind of average Joe Blogs like me had a crack at it. Because I think they were up on the website for about an hour or something, they were only selling that fast. Right, we've got a Gavardio, a Ronaldinho, oh, I think I've seen it. It's a heritage, it's a heritage insert, I'm not sure these are just in it. Oh, it's a tribute. Tribute. Michael Loudrop. The Ronaldinho is numbered to 53. So just is there a reason for that? Such a bizarre number enough. When we look at the 
piece of wall drop membro pibu ya no se de gente Piece of game worn jersey 1988 euros That's pretty cool Actually something from a major tournament Number to 21, 18 of 21 Don't think we're beating the Ronaldinho. Like something a game one piece for the the, the eighty eight euros is pretty good, pretty cool. Like, um, I mean, it could have been worse. It could have been his brother. I'm not too fussed about Michael to be honest. He played for Barca, so it's pretty <laughs> mad. Uh, right, we've got Virgil. Hero to Mobley Heritage insert number to thirty five. Uh, Victor Ozzie Men, Ellen Haaland, Thierry Henry. One box left. Drop. Roger number two again. 21. We're getting. We're actually getting more number cards than I thought we would. I thought we would only get one number per box, but we're past four numbered already. On top of the on top of the memorabilia stuff. Specifically, we're not bought a big box of 55 point top models for these, sorry, but all the base cards will get loaded as well after this. Not that noticeable, you know. Sometimes you get unlicensed cards that are a wee bit look a bit shit. They've chosen the images quite well on this. Let's see if I've uh, We might have got an extra card. Let's be back unless I've put an extra card in the spreadsheet. Right, last box. Then we can get to figuring out who's getting what. Chunky one, two, two for the back here. No, didn't they? I think that. I thought that was a mark on the card. It's just a design. Here goes Jota. That is numbered. The uh, forty-seven. Another strange bit of numbering. Torres Gabby, nice one Julian Alvarez I think we may have cracked it again. <laughs> Legacy. <laughs> Ronaldo. 
Who killed our patch? What a man! For the World Cup qualifiers in 2010. Look at that man, the, the fucking bit of the collar sticks out of the card. Fucking Ronaldinho. 1-1. One, one. Oh, the, the car, sorry. No disrespect to her. <sighs> so somebody, for a score, is walking away with a Ronaldinho. 1-1, one, one, game won. I thought the other Ronaldinho might have been like the the fucking box hit because every box has like a biggie. It's either an you either get an auto a one one or a right. I'm just gonna keep this in the sleeve though because I'm not entirely sure that I'll fit in a one thirty point top loader. <laughs> it's fucking huge. Hey, or a gold plate, yeah. I don't want to fuck with it, right, I don't want to fuck with it, it's just going to stay in the sleeve now, I'm not going to let it go. Um, but a legacy Ronaldinho. 101. I'm just going to quickly look at this top loader again. I don't want to fuck with this, like... If I need to put it in like a case or something. Some kind of plastic case, then that's what I'll do. <laughs> I'll find something that I've got in this house. It's a bit iffy. So I'm not going to fuck with it now. I'm fucking petrified to do anything to it though. Uh, give me a wee second. I've got loads of like wee plastic cases that top send cards out in. That I might be able to use that are more appropriate. Sure I've got something. No, oh, I don't. You just see it tap my head for a wee minute. Two seconds. That could be the very boy. Right, my uh, numbered baseball card patch is getting fucked in the, into the box. You can go in this and down until I can figure it out. I'll get, I'll get something decent to send it in, but this is this will at least keep it well protected. Awesome. Aye. Right. Well, at least keep it very well protected. Chances with this thing. But it, it's encased now. <laughs> they room for, there's no room for moving that thing, so. I'd say I'll hang fire. I'll hang fire until everybody gets back. Who's getting it? Got a sticker on the back of that fucking case as well. Right. So that's the Ronaldinho 1-1. Right, we're all back. Good. But yeah, I need to finish my fucking spreadsheet now. Get rid of that. I had a chunky, like a pretty chunky baseball uh, card patch in that. Put it next to yours and somebody else. <laughs> right, Ron. One on one. Right. I 
think we've got an extra card. I don't. A Jota. Uh, whoever wins the runner, Daniel, I'll buy something to put it in. Um, because I'm no. Let's see, it just looked like it was a wee bit of a tight fit for a 130 point top loader, so. Uh, forty-seven. So we've actually got one. Or five numbered cards. Let's just check this. More numbered cards. Right. More cards in this box than I thought. So somebody's getting a couple. I'm going to still right. Multi 19. That's six numbered. So we've got Venus Junior to 10, right? We've got this Jota, 47, Ronaldinho. 53, Immobile, 35, Bastoni, 34, Rude Van Nistelrooy to 19, and then the first card we got out was a Vinnie Junior to 10. So there's a couple of nice cards there for folks. We've got the Michael Loudrup, uh, game worn 88 euros to 21. We've got the Mexico Jewel patch, which is Lozano. Uh, Lozano's an Apple jersey, the. Uh, Hernandez one is game one Mexico jersey against the USA and then we've got two Brazil away jersey right, Ronaldinho in a fucking one of one <laughs> home jersey Ronaldinho um, so what I'll do seeing as we've got a couple of extra cards uh, Alba and Nakata can go together. And I don't know, fucking Donnarumma and Kimmich can go together. I don't know, there's so some some of the base card spots are gonna have two in them now. So we get two more cards than I thought we would. Yes. Right. Save the spreadsheet. Okay. This is the Just double trying to get this right. Twenty six. That's thirty, right? So two of the base card spots I've just paired together. So whoever gets there's some some people will get two there's two guys that will get two base cards. So we've got Kimmich and Don in the room together and Alba and the cat together. And there's a fucking shite myself. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's gonna get a fucking one on one. Uh, what are we just randomizer? Straightforward randomizer? Or a duck race for the, uh, the Ronaldinho? Is there any preference? I've got the, the randomizer window open anyway. So, randomizer, what I would do is just randomize everybody's name. <laughs> then randomize the cards, and whatever one's next to yours in the spreadsheet, that's what you get. If that seems fair. Randomizer, aye. Seems a fair, it does, aye. Right, cool. Name order, right. Good luck, everybody. Okay. So, first thing we'll do, and delete that last column, actually. That doesn't make any sense. Right. Just big this up a wee bit so that folk can actually see. Okay, 
right now, everybody's name. So we've got Paul at the top and Stephen at the bottom, right? And then Paul at the top, Stephen at the bottom. Now, I'll roll the dice, see how many times I randomise it. Five, right. One, two, three, four, five, right. Is this now, I'm now at the point where... Oh, no, 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 no. There's only 26 names there. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How could that happen? There's two names in the They're still there. They're still on the fucking spreadsheet. Oh my word. Thank God I didn't go through all that. Right, start again. Fuck me. <laughs> Just fucking start again. Thank fuck, I didn't I notice that. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell, man. Right. So the actual spreadsheet, it should be Paul at the top and David at the bottom. See if I'd have done the fucking randomizer after that, I'd have just ended the stream and just fucking never, you'd have never heard from me again. That'd have been a shop shut, liquidated. <laughs> so... On the spreadsheet, top name's Paul, the bottom name's David. On the randomizer, Paul, David, right, fucking hell. Yeah, um, roll the dice again, right? My brain's doing stupid things, right? Two, one, two. So Reg, down to Lee. I think Reg was number one in the, the first time I did it anyway. Marcus, thanks for the follow, mate. Really appreciate it. You're just watching me absolutely fucking shit myself. Trying to randomise a card that's probably the... <laughs> um, which is... I don't think I'm going to top a fucking one one Ronaldinho. Ever. Right. We've got Reg going down to Lee. On the screen, it's Reg down to Lee. Right, so we've got everybody. That's your order. Zoom out a bit. That's your order there. These are the cards. Now I'm going to randomise the cards. See, the ones with two names are just base, extra base cards we got. Right, so it's Ronaldinho, all the way down to Alvarez, right? And I've got the Ronaldinho... <laughs> I just doubt myself here. I've got all the numbered cards on there. And I've got the four. So Ronaldinho Mem 32 is the away jersey. Ronaldinho Mem 101, you get it, right? Uh, Ronaldinho going down to Alvarez, right? And then we've got Ronaldinho, and Dante Alvarez, roll the dice, seven. <laughs> this is now where I'm starting to doubt my, my ability to click a mouse seven times in a row properly. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, right good luck everybody. Seven. Number four. Who's got the Ronaldinho? 101. Is number four. It is. Michael. There you go, mate. So let's 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 look at the biggies, right? Michael, congratulations, mate. Ronaldinho 101. Niall, you've got the Ronaldinho at 53. Uh, that's not the. That's the numbered card, not the patch. 
Uh, Rob, you have a road, Rude Van Nistelrooy to 19 base. David, you've got the Mexico dual patch. Red, you've got a Jota number to 47. Lee, Harper, you've got an Immobile to 35. Stuart, you've got the Bastoni base to 34. Jason, you've got the Loudrop memorabilia card number to 21. Ben, you have the other Ronaldinho memorabilia card to 32. Congratulations, mate. Kyle's got the um, the Vinny Junior to 10, which is still a pretty good one to hit. I'll blow this up a wee bit. That's all the kind of hits, but... Michael Mansion, man. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I mean, the 32, I thought the 32 Ronaldinho was going to be as good as we would get. Um, so we've got Reg, you've got a Camavinga, Ian, you've got the Haaland, Kelly Vardy all, Mark, you've got the Ronaldo, Brazilian Ronaldo, Sean's on a Gavi, Warren's got a Kunde, Billy, you've got a Thierry Henry and an Aussie Hen, Michael, you've got an Alvarez, Paul, you've got the Neymar, Rob's got a Havertz, Raymond's got a uh, Pau Torres, Lee, you've got Kimmich and a Donna Rumor. You, Rob's got the Virgil van Dijk. Steven, you've got an Alba and Nakata. Paul Bisland's got Batis Stuta. Niall, you've got Teo Hernandez. And then Lee, your sex spot is a CR7. So, thank you all very much for that and for putting up with my fucking mild panic attack that I was having trying to put a spreadsheet together. <laughs> ah! I don't think I'll ever have, right, probably not. He's on the arse looking at, eh... Uh, keep eye on in case anyone needs it. If anyone needs it, like I say, I'll, I'll sleeve up these base cards and put them into 55 points. Um, that. There's a, I've got a price stick on the back of this plastic case that I've got, but I will get something better to put this in before I send it to you. This is just so that it is absolutely fucking secure. Like, if it's just kind of flush into this, so there's no fucking about the corners or anything. I don't know, Dino 1-1. Then we've got the Mexico. The jersey patches are fucking dynamite in this, man. See, the thing is, see, when I look at the, the first the first couple of boxes that I watched, I seen somebody, I seen a few, and there was like, wasn't many autos in them, and I thought, that's not, a, and then I seen, what the jersey patches were, and then I seen what the autos were, and I was like, actually, I'd rather have a fucking like, I'd rather have the jersey patch than a fucking, you know, Steve McMahon and one card number the four hundred. Eh, uh, I mean, see if you see if somebody said to you beforehand if you could that was the buy-in for a random hit at a fucking Ronaldinho one on one, it's pretty good value for money. <laughs> Some for a score, somebody just got a fucking Ronaldinho one on one, but that's mental. Um. I'm waiting for the light in now. Even the base cards, like I say, base cards are cracking quality. They're really nice. I'm not sure they actually are the base cards, the ones that I think. If there's any colour in amongst it, I don't think there is. Even just like that, that over is. The choice of images, the, the, the images are really nice on it. Like, you don't really kind of. It doesn't really ruin it that they've got a. They've not got a license for it. Anyway. I think I. I I think, aye, the individual card draw, you're not going to get much change of £20 for a normal Futera card draw, anyway. Um, so I figured that was the best way to do it, so that everybody at least got a nice card. I was going to do random countries, but then fuck, if you get Brazil in that, Christ! But then the thing is, I've seen people doing random, like, I looked at pick your team countries, and people are charging like 120 quid for Brazil and Argentina, and I was like, fuck, if you paid 120 quid, I'd have been embarrassed to sell like a hundred pound spot for Argentina to somebody, but then 
It's luck of the draw, I suppose. Let's say you could have paid a hundred pound for Brazil and probably God knows how much you'd multiplied your money there. Aye, man. <laughs> what a fucking what a box, man. I'm gonna do a wee bit of digging online now, see if I can find another one for somewhere. That isn't already ludicrously priced, because that break I was pretty much doing at the resale price for the box. I thought I can either resell the box sealed or I can have a bit of fun opening it. Quite glad I did though. Uh, but yeah, I'll maybe see what I can do. I've not actually got anything last last me. Let's see the fucking website. I've on the website. I believe. Everything on the website. I sold it. All, all my wee boxes. Mm, Spreadsheet out of the way. All the breaks, all the wee, all the wee sealed boxes, everything sold out. Hopefully, Tops get their finger out and start dishing out some of their um, print on demand stuff. Like uh, the Merlin 98, a few boxes are coming. But I'll hopefully be live next Thursday and can maybe figure out. I'm going to get my hands on something between now and then. But uh, thank you all very, very much for that. That was. Uh, I haven't. Despite the fact that I looked like I was about to have a heart attack for most of it, I really enjoyed that. <laughs> At least I've got something to post on my fucking new TikTok pish now. <laughs> Don't raise the box, fuck! Right, the box. Thanks for reminding me. Mosaic. NFL. Could get more mosaic. Um, does anybody want the box? Or will I just duck race, right? Will I just duck race the box between amongst the people that are that are bought into the break, or, or is that a bit daft? As some people may not want it. Merlin, I've said literally see everything I've got sitting here. It'll go now because I was just waiting. If there's stuff you've got sitting with me, it, the only reason I was waiting is because I knew I was doing this. And I just wanted to send it all at the same time. Um, so I've got. What have I got? It's mostly Merlin, some NFL stuff. Sent a chunk it. We just do. Oh, the 98 ones? I'm thinking, right, so it was about. It was about a fortnight after the Bellingham Platinum set. Now, I know it's a bigger hobby box and the collection might take a bit longer than that, but. I'm thinking, like. I think they, they can't be far away from having that because. It, it's about the same length of time from when the Bellingham box arrived to now, to when the Bellingham box was released and the Merlin 98 was released, if that makes sense. So you think if that's how long it takes them to collate and send out print to order sets, but I know that there was a lot more of the, a lot more of the Merlin 98 ones. So you don't know. Right, is anybody... Should I just, should I just do the box as a, if you bought a spot in the break, is that the fairest way to do it? Because I might be folded have fucked off now that I've finished stitching out the cards. <laughs> I'll figure out something to do with the box, because so there'll be people that's a really fucking nice box. I'll do that, right? We'll do a duck race with everybody that was in the in the break. So somebody can get a nice wee surprise. And let's say if I tell you what, right, I'll keep I'll keep a note of the order. If the person that wins this isn't in the stream and I message them and they don't want it, I'll Walk my way down the fucking list and <laughs> phone you all or something to try and get it to you who wants it. Right. Save my spreadsheet. I'll do it. Dot race for box. Right. This is actually, I mean, you could, it's a really nice box. If you pull, there's a wee thing that said you pull the top out, you can fit top loaders all the way along it. Um, so but let's just make sure I'm not fucking missed any this time. Reg down to Lee, right? Reg down to Lee. That's that's that. Right. Um. Oh fuck! Move that over here a wee bit just so everybody can see it. Right. So this is a duck race for the Futeri Unique box, which I'll figure out a way of sending it to somebody. Because it is, let's say, it's a really nice box, it's meant, it's designed to fit top loaders in all the way along. 
So you can probably store about 100 cards in this thing. Got loaded. Nice wee piece of kit. Going to somebody in 30 seconds, so best of luck. See, it's never good. I, I, I can't. I'm the same as you, I can put I join breaks all the time. And I'm a sucker for daft fucking fillers and stuff like that, where you chuck away like a fiver. Um, and it's never good to be in the lead really early in these dot races, although I think Paul's going to overtake himself. Oh, Kyle's coming up the outside. He's going to take it. Mr. Walker, congratulations, you're now the proud owner. The Futera Unique Box. <laughs> I'm gonna look it up. I mean, yeah, I'll, I'll comp that on eBay and there'll be somebody selling the box for like 30 quid or something. So, we had Kyle. Mate, I was at the fix. People are gonna be calling this a fix now because Mike, Michael's up near the top again this as well. So, I've asked Kyle and he doesn't want it. Uh, Kyle Walker, he's been rapid down the outside right there. <laughs> um, if he doesn't, I'll give him a shout. If he doesn't want it, it'll go to Michael. If he doesn't want it, it'll go to you. know what I mean? I'll just walk my way down. But that, that's how I'm gonna decide who gets the box. Thanks for reminding me about that, I totally fucking forgot I'd even said that. I'm just going to scroll down this slowly so I've got it on the stream. So that I've got a record of it, in case I do this, because I'm terrible for doing this, right? I hit Control C, and it disappears. And then I shit myself, because I think I've lost it. But... I have it. It's still copies. Left. Yeah. So we've got I've got a record of that as well. Just in case anyway. So that's the duck race from the box there. I'll save that in my spreadsheet. Kyle's won. He only got a base card. He only got a, a, a Gavardi old base card in the in the break, so he got a, a nice wee box to go with it. A nice box to keep in. Um, but yeah, thank you all very much for that, I do appreciate it. Um, and once my heart rate goes back down, I'm going <laughs> to look and try and get some boxes in for next week. I'm trying to do it every, I've been doing it every Thursday uh, this year so far. And like my the odd night scattered about here and there in between. But um I don't know, I might start doing like, if I can't get any break I might just like get somebody on the stream for a chat, to like a podcast or something. Really haven't thought this through, I'm thinking out loud in front of, you, in front of the half a dozen people that are still here. Um, but yeah, no, thank you all very, very much for that, cheers, I'll, I mean, I, um, it's always a bit daunting when you've sunk a fair chunk of your cash into uh, boxes to release things and it's, it's really, I do, it's not lost on me the appreciation that I get uh, for people and um, you know the fact that he's come out and buying these breaks means a lot so yeah we've had, that's, that's me basically came to the end of the stock that I've got there now and I'm waiting on more stuff coming in but thank you all very very much and uh, I'll see you hopefully next Thursday, let's see if I've not got, I've got nothing to break I'll maybe stream something else um, we've just passed the hour mark so it's probably a good time to Stop talking pish. <laughs> I'll catch you later. Cheers.